Hey guys, welcome back to a new vlog. My name is Nelo Weke and I'm a YouTuber based in Abuja, Nigeria. So today's video, you guys already know it's all about fashion. I'm already like living for it already. And it's all about um, fashion trends that, you know, is in the spring summer. Basically even 2023 if I'm being honest. But so let's get right into it. If you want to see that, please grab your popcorn and drink. Let's get into fashion. <laughs> okay. The first one I'll be talking about is pop of color and that is lemon green or lemon color. It is so huge this spring summer. Bauman and H&M collaboration that is coming out, I think May 10th or she's even been out already, I don't know. Yes, well I know it's this month and it's the first week of this month. It, it has like this lemon, there's this lemon um, bodycon ruched dress with a cut at the neckline. Ah, it's, I live for it. Although I would love that clothes to be uh, midi. I'm not, I, I'm not really short. I'm not really a fan of short dresses. Then there's this other men, I think it's a men blazer that they have. There's also a lemon color. It does not have a um, lapel. It does not have lapel. Ha! I live for those two pieces. So lemon is so in. And I also be popping the pictures of everything I'm talking about here so you can see it. Lemon is so huge now. And this dress I'm sorry, it's a lemon dress. I can't wait to be done with it. I'm done with it. I'm going to film like just I'm going to get one video to that dress. For that dress, it's going to be a get ready with me. Probably a date night or something. So I'm going to be wear it. Yeah, so lemon is so huge this period. So if you want to like incorporate that into your robe, you can do so. If you're not also a fan of lemon, that's cool. So the second trend that is in that I'm so loving is huge. I feel like at this point, everyone is just overdoing, they're not doing the most, but I still like it. Is it the main trend? Like the main on the main, like it makes so much sense. Like I love it. I love like when the demain the top is not like a corset. So it's like a demain corset and then the trouser with something. Or even have like a three piece, a blazer, a crop top, and then the trouser or a skirt or whatever. But the demain trend is so huge and I'm living for it and I'm here for it all the way 100 percent I want to film a video like styling like demain looks and I am almost there. I'm almost like I'm almost done getting all my demean looks together when i get everything together i'm going to definitely film that video because the main like the main trend i really really love it so any trend i love i'm going to partic partic participate in it so the next trend i'm talking about is ah that one is everybody already know it is corset corset is so huge this year you have different types of corsets the three and uh, the two breast corset the three parts corset you have the victorian corset you have the corset that is a uh, the underboss corset you have like different types of corset even the corset that come without crop like different ways in which you can corset your life like corset is so in if you're not comfortable buying or getting the corset that you know that one that you have to like cinch your waist and all of that you don't you're not about that like you like comfortability you can buy all these um street um all these casual tops that are done in a corset form but doesn't have any bone in like it means aesthetics of a corset but it doesn't really have the actual functionality of a corset yes you can get that going for you and guys corset is so huge i want to tell you about corset is that it can elevate your outfit you can just wear the corset and then you top and the skirt and then you look good like you're good to go it's a fashionable piece that once you get it's obviously going to elevate your wardrobe so the third one or oh, sorry sorry the fourth trend that i am really loving this year is the cabbage pants the first one that really made me i wanted to go mad was i think this article their cargo pants their cargo pants is spectacular i love the way the cut is i love everything about our cargo pants when our cargo pants are everywhere because that article one is so expensive so you can also get the affordable ones you can also make it for yourself and then by that you don't do the demand trend you know right? you're not wearing a you're doing three trends in one you're doing like the main upon the main so now the top is going to be a corset the main corset and the pants is going to be a jean cargo jean oh my god about what are you not talking about like that's a stella look and i want to do that look like a demean corset and a demean cargo pants it's gonna bang like it always bangs which one i see it on instagram it always bangs probably with like a pointed heel shut the door <laughs> shut the door like no what the fuck don't be she's the way you who nobody <laughs> nobody can be you so like the cargo pants i love it it's so huge i like the man's cargo Pants trend is that it's not more that you must do it in a jean or cargo material. You can even use like silk to help make it have a more dressy, relaxed vibe. You can even use like a little softer material. So I've noticed it done on, I think it's also CB. I've done it on um, as in crinoline. It looks like organza, it looks like a fluid organza. So the fifth one I'm talking about is statement jewelries. 
they are so huge this year you have the shokas you have like the statement earring like fashion this year is just giving like extra 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 and i'm so here for it you have the shokas you have like the statement earrings i know bottega came out with this statement earring that everybody wants to go mad they all have it even the dupes of that bottega ear earring which i'm going to link here zara is another another place a fashion brand that they do justice to statement earrings and um, necklaces like earrings that you can you can center your your outfit or you like your whole outfit on just that jewelry you can wear a simple neck and um, outfit for your earring or you're going to wear like a very statement shocker and another thing about these statement jewelry is, is that it's not more that you're going to do silver or gold and even incorporate like texture into the statement earring or the statement jewelry which leads me to my next fashion trend which are roses roses are so huge this year yeah? let me give you references let us start with med gala what did rihanna wear it was a 3d sculpture and roses that a reference to chanel and carl lagerfield like and she said that one of the roses took 30 hours for the artisans to like do it second um whatever second proof or second whatever Cardi B, did you see the Chanel, the Barbie look that she gave, the black with the collar shirt with the tie and then that big quilted material that has a 3D roses on it. <laughs> it's everything, roses are everywhere. Even this guy, is he, this, this person's husband, I can't remember, he wore the white suit with the cut at the back holding the shawl that has roses all over. Roses are so ABCAB and of course, I'm giving you guys the roses also. <laughs> So yeah, for the roses. But I'm going to put a video of this dress here so you can see the full sleigh. Yeah, another way you can incorporate the roses into your outfit. You also have like now these big roses as shokas. Even though I've seen roses that are like jewelry. I've seen them to Bali has worn something like that. These are so in. It's a huge trend. You can incorporate it anyhow you want. You can like it because it gives like this girly feminine vibe. Like it just softens your look up. Like that's one thing about roses I love. So the next poor fashion trend that we are liking this year is maxi skates like ma not like skates let me rephrase myself maxi like long dresses midi dresses maxi dresses long skirts are so huge this this period and i'm so here for it because if you guys know already for the ten tenth or one million times i am not a fan of short dresses even like i i prefer on my body and also my fashion preference i prefer long dresses give me midi dresses i love dresses that are midi so that it can further accentuate my shape and just give me what i want and that is what we are here for so you're going to see you're seeing more of like maxi dresses if you're in nigeria yeah, Bubu, yeah, they want to use bubu to finish us here in the form of a, a maxi outfit like evening mm, like maxi dresses and um, long skirts even the main the main also came out like there's this trend of the main that is also like long skirts or midi dresses long out dresses like it's so huge and even we do like the long pants like it is so huge this period and i'm living and i'm loving the trend because i'm all about that and let me also tell you as a covid girl like me go for long dresses it doesn't have to be a long dress like it's the ground you can go for midi what this will do for you it will help to accentuate your curve and that is a trend that i am solid behind by the way if you're enjoying this video and you're enjoying my vibe and you're enjoying everything please subscribe to my channel and thumbs up this video right now which leads me to my next point which are like statement bags these are the kind of bags that are not like our, your regular kind of bags two brands i know that they do justice to like statement awkward piece kind of bags is bottega and cod gaia cod gaia just gives you like this amazing um vacation pieces i'm not even can you wear it to your like everyday um, um outfit but they do justice to like timeless or like statement bags bags that are like awkward cod gaia like just <sighs> bottega is another one that but one time I think I don't know it's beginning to give much it's beginning to give like trendy like I don't know it's going to give like fast it's not fast fashion. Let me don't use the word fast fashion, let me don't disrespect some of this brand. But I don't know the way like it's everywhere. The dupes are everywhere. But I will not so I will not so fraud them because the bags are killer. <laughs> so anybody wants it, so you cannot afford the original one, you go for the dupe, like ah, they do like bags that are like 
like dressy bags elevated bags like it's not a boring bag their take on how they like make bags like you can build your outfits around these bags but there are some bags that you use them to complement an outfit so to elevate that outfit you're going to the next level and then there are some bags that you build your outfits around the bag this i think these two brands they did for me big bags are also making it back into trend because you know at some point it was like the small like those tiny bags that are like unrealistic that we are like everywhere and then smaller bags also but then big bags are like coming in like big bags are coming back into trend and i am so here for it bags that you can carry and they're functional actually it's very functional and big bags and i think i know the reason why big bags because fashion like it just stylish it makes sense big bags are coming in because big bags go so well with magazine outfits if you're wearing a maxi dress with a big bag a kind on your hand like a statement big bag and also a structured big bag that look is stellar like that look is divine so i think i'm beginning to understand why big bags are like back in trends anyway these are the fashion trends that i love and i'm so here for and i always know i'm going to like incorporate or i'm already incorporating into my into my wardrobe please let me know in the comment section the trends that you yourself you are living for this period okay and if you love this video please and if you love what i'm about don't forget to subscribe to my channel thumbs up this video and i will see you guys in my next one bye bye